What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. As you can tell by the title, today we're gonna to be installing the NVIDIA R400 on my 2017 STI. The reason I went with the R400 is because number one, NVIDIA just sounds amazing. Number two, I like the quad look over the other looks. And number three, those four inch tips just really fill in the hole. <laughs> So I wanted to go ahead and put together this video for those of you that are going to be installing this exhaust soon. Maybe you can kind of get a head start and see what, what you're going to expect when you're going to install this. Maybe you'll learn something, get some tips. So when you go to do this, you kind of know what to expect um, and it'll be problem free. But we know working on cars, there's always something that goes wrong, right? Maybe a bolt doesn't come off or whatever. But anyways, all right, I'm getting exhausted. See you guys there. Let's jump right into it. So right now we're starting off by taking off the mufflers, these little baby guys. Right now we got them on ramps. All right, so right now we're looking at four of these for the mufflers. So also make sure to spray the hangers with like WD-40 or something to loosen it um, to make it easier to slide out. Make sure to spray that hanger as well. Um, so we already undid the bolts for the muffler. They were 14 millimeter. All right, so when taking these off, this side's gonna be 14 millimeters, this side's gonna be 12. And now, here's one of the hangers you're gonna be taking off. It just happened to be easier to take it off from that side, so we're gonna be putting the hanger back on. All right, next we're gonna be taking these mufflers off right here. So they're already unbolted. We're gonna take them off. There should be two hangers, one right here, and the other one's on this side all the way down there. Downstairs. You wanna help, Boo? All right, guys, so we are out with the old, and we're going in with the new. All right, so there's one of the hangers um, we left on there for that muffler. It was just, these were easy enough to uh, take off the muffler came right off. This side was actually easier than this side, I think because there was more more room on the left side, on the driver's side. Um, but yeah, so now we're going to start installing a new one. I got a Grim Speed, uh, what's it, adapter for the uh, three inch to two and a half, uh, the stock downpipe, keeping the stock downpipe for now. So we'll be putting that on. All right, so here's the, the stock downpipe side. Um, we'll be installing the uh, new R400 right to that. Everything else wide open. All right, so Grim Speed came with a, uh, a gasket. We're gonna put on the the mid pipe to connect to the down pipe. Um, so this is a gasket, and then we have the little adapter here, which is two and a half to three inch. We're gonna be putting that on there as well, and then connecting this to the stock down pipe right now. All right, so we went ahead and connected these two pieces together. Um, so we can just put it down there as one piece and hang this on the hanger. Um, so we use the gasket right here in the middle, connected these two together with the bolts, both sides. It's much easier putting these in than taking them out. This will be the lay it lightly. Yeah, now I'll take a picture. Old and new with the Corona. All right, so here's the down pipe to the exhaust connection. The adapter's in there, and the old gasket from the down pipe's in there, and the new gaskets on the uh, exhaust side. Alright guys, so I've had the exhaust installed for a few days now and it sounds amazing. I love the way it sounds. I would say it's a little louder than I thought it would be from inside the car, um, but I mean it's still drivable. It was just from my expectations what I thought it was going to be. It's, it's louder than what I thought, but it does sound nice. It has the, the perfect rumble. Um, I'm going to put some sound clips in it right now. I'm going to try to record some some startup, some RPM, some maybe some uh, like launch control and I'll do some drive-bys and stuff. Thank you. 
So here's a little idea of how it sounds in the car. Alright guys, so the exhaust sounds amazing. The, the rumble, everything from the tone of it, it just sounds great. The only thing I didn't expect was it's a little louder in the cabin than I expected. Um, but it's still like drivable. I can still talk on the phone. Um, it's not as bad, that bad. So I don't want to try to scare you guys away from it. It's still a great product. It looks nice under there. Um, and it definitely, I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like driving, it almost, feel, uh, almost feels smoother shifting into gears. So yeah, um, if you guys enjoy this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Uh, comment down below and subscribe if you haven't already for some more 2017 and some 2019 STI content coming soon. Shout out to my cousin. Congrats on that new STI. We'll be working on his car as well. So subscribe.